What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Last break of the night, 2021 Panini Prism Football Hobby 6-box half case break. Page teams number 6, remember all cards ship. And this is the second half of the case. And would you look at that? We sold it out straight up. Sean Maddock got last ball mojo Broncos. And of course, there's everybody else that bought in straight up as well. Thank you guys for the fill. I was just curious to see what this six box half case had. Because we didn't really pull too many big rookie, you know, quarterbacks actually in general autographs. So, I don't know. It makes me believe that there could potentially be something nice here. So, I'm actually kind of happy I'm doing it. I, I, I personally kind of hate when, like, I only get to do a half case break and the half that I got randomized to do is not the best. And then someone else comes and breaks it and then... You know, they get to get the, the feeling of pulling a, a pretty nice card, so I'm a little I'm a little jealous like that, so I'm glad you guys filled it up. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to find the missing colors, but I'm just wondering if, like, these boxes are just loaded. You know? All right, here we go, guys. Rashawn Gary. One seventy-five. Rich Gannon, Raiders. Anthony with the Raiders. We got Jabril Cox. Eric Metcalf to ninety nine. We got Jamin Davis, Washington football team. AJ Brown, yeah, th th I think Prism is the, one of the better products to do as a case break and a pick your team because uh, obviously you know if you're gonna want some of the bigger teams you're gonna have to pay up but yeah some of these teams that aren't priced so high because they may not have the biggest rookies or you know just great checklists in general they actually tend to hit a lot more than those bigger teams and you paying a small fraction of the price like I say for the commanders for 60 70 bucks I mean not bad at all. Kyler Murray. To 199. Damon Harris. Jalen Phillips. 249, all out Travis Kelsey. Amari Cooper, 13 out of 60. Marshawn Lattimore to 249. At least, right? Chuba Hubbard. Autograph. Tilo. Taysom Hill. Chase. 
Chaz Surratt. Two twenty-five and Mark, is that ripen? Sensational signatures, green scope to That's what I feel about Coops. Ah! Right there. Next box, guys. Good luck. Oh, no. Don't tell me we got another one of these boxes here. Unbelievable. Come on. Ugh. Kenny Gainwell? What the hell, man? Harris. <laughs> I, I need to get home and get some sleep. <laughs> I don't know if you were here earlier, but I, I didn't get to sleep at all yesterday. We had the ER for like six hours to finally get uh, my wife seen, and then from like 12:30 to 6:30, and then we didn't get out of the ER until like 1:30 right before I started work at three. <laughs> we got uh, Ambry Thomas. I don't know. I'm gonna, I'll message Nick about it. I'll message him though, it's, it's just a little too weird. Javon the Freak Curse. Yeah, she is, thankfully, Chad. She had a little, like, a procedure on Friday. Um, you know, nothing crazy, just a little procedure she had to do. And, um, you know, I, I, she didn't come to work yesterday, but she was feeling, like, some discomfort kind of pain in her chest um and uh so when I got home like at midnight last night like 12 30 you know she was telling me like oh it's kind of hard to breathe and I'm just my stomach hurts and so I said well damn let's go to the urgent care then you know see maybe we can see what's going on but they were technically closed called trash so I had to go to we had to go to the ER but it took like six hours like literally for us to be seen you know so <laughs> We were there from like 12.45 to like 6.45 till finally they seen us. And they just did a bunch of lab work, you know, just making sure that everything was okay, or, you know, organs, did a CAT scan and make sure there wasn't like any blood clots in her chest because that was one thing that they thought could have been, 
blood work and all that, but thankfully it wasn't that. It was just something, uh, and I think Diego earlier mentioned it, but basically I guess with the anesthesia, it kind of messed her up where uh, the, like, the lower part of her lungs kind of, uh, I, don't know, I, don't, I don't remember the right term she said, but basically think of it as like a smaller, like a mini like collapse of a lung where like kind of like she needs a couple of days for her body to kind of like like readjust like I guess her breathing so that's why like when she took any deep breaths it was like hurting but you know we just wanted to be safe but it was, it was so crazy that we we're there for like 13 hours and then I was just like worried because I'm like man like if it's something serious I won't be able to make it and like and I I don't it's too late to have someone cover me like no one's gonna be here to cover me so you know what am I gonna do but thankfully it wasn't serious so um I was able to drive her home at 1 30 get home like at 2 so I'm only like 15 20 minutes away from the Kaiser we went to I quickly took a shower and then I headed over here to the shop so I was like I'm running on like no sleep all right next box so that's why I said like I'll break this box but <laughs> I'm done after this Nice, Matthew. Nice. Yeah, nice little uh, trash grate there. Yeah, I know. I mean, you know, obviously there was other people there that probably, you know, obviously had, you know, feeling worse and some serious stuff. But obviously, I, they all, they try to treat it as equally as possible. I remember this one lady was able to, like, uh, cut, like, so many of us because, like, I mean, she was literally, like, bleeding. <laughs> I'm like, well, you're going to let her sit there for six hours? Like, you know? So it's, it depends on the severity. Obviously, and for the most part, what we described, it didn't seem like they did. They did an EKG right away when we got there. But once they seen that that was fine, then I think they said, "Okay, well, you might have to like tough it out because you know there's other people that have been waiting here." You know. Thank you. Yeah, she is, man. But yeah, I. I I've been actually meaning to go to Sharky's. I've been wanting to go, and I told Vanessa that the other day too, but I can't do it right now. <laughs> but yeah, it was crazy. I hadn't had like an all-nighter like that, like no sleep in a long time. He went to the ER last year and it took them far to see me and I didn't even see anyone? What the hell? Justin Jefferson. Yeah, I think urgent care would have been great, but it was it closes at 9. I didn't realize they closed at... I, I mean, I get. It's urgent care. It's not like emergency. and more like after midnight type of deal. It's more of an emergency if you need to see somebody. So I get why it was closed, but I think we would have gotten easier and faster help there. But, oh well. Parsons. Moster. Ray Sanders. Oh, yeah, well, what, what, what was it after all? My brother actually had appendicitis the, uh, last year. He actually had to have his appendix removed. It, like, almost burst it. But I guess now, I guess now it's, they have better treatment for that. Like, they can actually kind of help you out without having to, like, have a surgery for you now, I guess, with a, with appendix, which is weird. I mean, I remember I was told, like, you know, obviously, you had to, like, obviously have surgery. But I guess now, whoa, look at that. Mac Jones and ugh, a little too heavy on the right side, but still a nice color. Mac Jones, thirty out of one twenty-five. That's going to the Patriots and Joshua.
Darnell Mooney. Jabril Cox. Oh, really? Wow. Logan Thomas. Jerome Bettis. Two forty nine, and how about a Trey Lance for the Niners? There's one of the bigger rookie quarterbacks we want to see. Very nice. That's going to Eric and the Forty Niners. Oh. Devin McCourty at two twenty five. Javon Holland, pro Doug, baby. 249. And Demarcus Lawrence. Really? Yeah, I don't know if I've ever heard of that. Whoa! What the hell? Another Trey Lance. Two Trey Lance autographs in the same box. Well, that, that might make up for the color. But it just sucks because Eric is the only one benefiting from this. <laughs> Two in the same box, Trey Lance. What the hell? Thought I was deja vu. I thought I was hallucinating right now. You know, I'm kind of just running on adrenaline right now. <laughs> I was like, did I just pull a magic trick and just untop load that and unpenny sleeve that? What the hell? Alright, well. Mac Jones and two Trey Lance. Hopefully a lot more than just that. Dude, I, I knew somebody um, that had their appendix burst inside of them. They, like, almost died. Right? Because it's very dangerous, right? The, the bacteria just spreads to all of your organs. I think it had just burst though too, and in the nick of time they were able to take them, take them to the hospital. But I knew a knew a guy that just like literally had the pain for days, and he just didn't want to go to the hospital until last minute he decides to go, and then it just like bursts. something Andre Reed well correct me if I'm wrong but we all had that because at one point right we all we ate was like just greens like just you know not really too much meat if I'm correct I think that's what I was told but now obviously we're not like that so it's kind of a useless thing Supposed to have like process like what people ate back in the day with the wild card points. Ooh, another case hit. Illuminations Josh Allen. And that's for the Bills going to Canard Bolt. Very nice. Wangu. And then we have a rewards. That is a wild card point. Oh, 
Oh, yeah. Who the, f who the hell's eating twigs and bark, though? <laughs> but I guess at one point that was food. Blood soda, 249. Vince Young. Titans. Chuba Hover Silver. Look at that. That is sweet. That's a nice card coming up right now. Van Jefferson. And how about a gold prism break insert of Justin Fields for the Bears. Sean Maddock bought that straight up today. Three out of ten. <laughs> I know, Rex. That's what I'm saying. But like, what the hell, dude? Allen Robinson. And we have very nice Micah Parsons. For the Dallas Cowboys. That's also Jeffrey bought straight up. 91 out of 149. Your defensive uh, rookie of the year. I think he was a finalist for defensive player of the year too, wasn't he? Or at least top five. Aaron Jones. Mac Jones. Goff. There's Aaron's favorite quarterback. To 75. Larry Roundtree. Ronald Jones. Another Micah Parsons color. Great break for the Cowboys. 24 out of 225. Did it really? Nice. Yeah, I didn't even know. A lot of those kind of players just kind of go under the radar, right? It's like they should be talked about, but then they're not. Two more boxes, guys. Almost there, almost there. <laughs> and I get that all the time from one of our customers, Golden. He's like, yeah, you should create that and put like ASMR. I'll listen to that all night. <laughs> Alright, good luck guys. Seconds to last box. Ronald Jones. 
Bucks, Rorick. Justin Simmons. Devontae. Javon Holland. Pro Duck. It's 189. Brian Dawkins. Julio Jones. Wow. What a break for the Bucks, too. How about that, Matthew? Off centered a little bit, but another nice Kyle Trask. 21 out of 25. And we got Deo. For the Colts, Green Scopes. Indianapolis Colts is going to Patrick Evans. James White. To 99. Kyle Rudolph, Giants. A little different, weird scene of in that uniform. And we have a Landon Collins. It's a 15. Washington uh, Commanders. Man, I, like, I love saying football team. It's going to be weird for me to say Commanders. Darnell Mooney, Burrs, Sean Maddock, Brandon Ayuk, I know, I already actually have broken the like Redskins habit, I just, I love saying Washington football team though, I like really loved it last year, <laughs> Khalil Herbert, so that's why it's like still popped into my head like that, whoa, Wow, hype. And I think that's a gold? It is. 10 of 10 Jalen Hurts. Hype insert. Very nice. I What the hell, dude? Panini, you have a whole year to get new photos of Jalen Hurts with number one. You used to put number two. Come on, man. Come on, man. Anthony. Ferkser. And James Harrison. Autograph there for the Steelers. Of course, when you have an eagle, you have to have a Steeler too, right? Steel curtain. Mike, we lose you with that one. All right, it's come down to the last box, guys. Thank you guys for filling us up again. I really appreciate it. You know, I did hate that we get we did get those two boxes. I'll see if I can tell Nick if they can do anything about it. I know, of course, what saves them is on average, right, 10 numbered prism. So that's why they put that, so they can save themselves. Because they know with the control, quality control, that there's going to be boxes that will be missing certain things. But we'll see if we can do anything about it. Because I know as a person, that would have been a bummer. Especially at that like thirteen hundred dollar price point. Yeah, again, man, you've been getting colors, but it hasn't been like the ones you wanted or like maybe as popular because they're kind of farmer players. But we did get to that Sean Taylor, though. Earlier, so.
All right, good luck, guys. Last box, Mojo. Ian Book for the Saints. That's going to Edward. LaMichael Piran. Russell Gage and a Derek Carr for the Raiders. It's a 225 Derek Carr autograph. And that's numbered to uh, 99. We got Hayden Hurst. A little hyper. No problem, Anthony. George Kittle to 125. Scary Terry McLaurin. We have Grady Jarrett. Another one there for the Falcons to 75. CJ Henderson. Alright, here we go, guys. Last second half here. Calias Campbell. And then we have a Kyle Travis. That's a true silver. Goffey. For the Lions. Austin Caruso. Trey Nixon. Damian Harris. It's one forty nine. Chris Evans and Patrick Jones the second for the Minnesota Vikings to 149 and Daniel Hunter for the Vikings Alright guys, well there you go. So, some nice cards on this side. Hype was really nice. Gold. Trask was really nice. Parsons. Parsons autograph. This was beautiful. Illumination. Josh Allen. Two Trey Lance autographs. Mac Jones purple. Kyle Trask again. Javon the Free Curse. Chuba Hubbard. Ripen. ETN emergent of uh, Michael Carter. Ambry Thomas. And again, we did get a wild card point. So we're going to give that out to one customer here. Uh, so like I said, I'll randomize the teams. Team at number one gets whatever. Uh, well, team at number one gets the wild card points. So let's just copy and paste the teams again. Roll it. Two and a four. Or four and a two six times. Two, three, four, five, six. Jaguars at the top. Jacksonville Jaguars going to Joshua. Joshua. So appreciate it, guys. Uh, if we did post up more, I don't know if Nick already did it, but if we are going to post up more, seven and eight will be the next ones we post up. Appreciate it, guys. JazbeesCaseBreaks.com.